Example two. Wat onnodig. 6 de term is minus 5. En die som van die tweede en die achtste term is minus 2. So the sum I'm saying. The sixth term is equal to negative 5. And the sum of the second and the eighth term is equal to negative 2. Okay. So kom ons skryf van neer wat ons het. Stem jylle som, ek weet. Term 6 is gelijk aan minus 5. Nee? Hoe kan ik term 6 gaan uitschrijven? In termen van A en B. A plus. Hou je in agreement? Hè? Je erbij? Oké. Okay. Wie wil iedereen proberen? Hoe kan ik daar gaan schrijven in termen van A en B? Look at them separately. Ja, gooi. A plus D. Plus. Amper. Ik hoor nog iets. Yes. Van, a, van die helikopter landing stasie af. Maak het vele sin? Jy gaan, wat, wat mis jy? Term 2 kan ek moet skryf as A plus D. Term 8 kan ek skryf as A plus 7D. So as hulle sê die som van die 2 is minus 2, dan gaan tel ek net die 2 goed by mekaar. Om minus 2 te kry. Goed. Ok. Hierdie keer gaan ek hier so makkelijk het kan vereenvoudig nie, maar kom ons doen het eerst gaan hierdie. Everyone happy with that? And then you go, you're fine? Good. Okay, and then this one happens to be divisible by 2. So why not? Let's just do it anyway. Okay? Okay, so that's my one equation. And then I'm going to copy my other equation in here. And once again, I'm going to subtract the two. So I'm going to say one minus two. Of, hoe jy ook al gelijktijdige oplossing doen. Betaai mense verkies om hierdie net te gaan skryf in terme van A. If you do that and then you substitute that in there, you're going to get the same answer. Okay? So, who you work on like that? So, I'm going to So, minus 1, minus, minus 5 is 4. A minus A cancels out. And that's minus D. <coughs> Sorry, guys. So D is equal to negative 4. I 
Ek gaan net vir iedereen een klaar maak, ek gaan ek om weer van die begin af saam met julle deurstaan. is equal to 15. Okay, let's talk about this one from the top. Does everybody understand the information that was given at the beginning? No? Say the term is minus 5, and then the sum of the 2 and the half term is minus 2. With other words, if I can tell the term, it's minus 2. So the negative 5 is equal to a plus 5d. Do we all understand that part? I'm all right. Then we have gone here and said, term 2 and term 8, kan ek afsonderlik gaan uitskryf as a plus d, that's for term 2, and a plus 7d. So I simplified that, got 2a plus 8d, and then I happen to be able to divide the, the whole thing by 2, just to make it easier. Okay? En toe kom ek uit by hierdie. So that is my one equation. This is my other equation. I got this all the way from there. And then I saw, okay, the A and the A will be able to cancel out if I just subtract the two from each other. As it needs to be easy, then you have the instel oplos moet gebruik, ne? But you have the kry in terms of an unbekende and om gaan instel and alles and alles. Substitution method. But elimination works here, so you can use it. It's not yourself what you have to Okay? Toe gebruik ek die laminatie en ek kom uit by deze minus 4. And then I substitute that back into either one of my equations to find A is minus 50. And now whatever they ask, you answer that. If they ask for the first three terms, you do that. If they ask for term 50, you do that. And blah, blah, blah. Okay.